How worried are you, Secretary General Ban, in terms of what could happen now in the world? I am deeply, deeply concerned about the current uh, status of uh, global politics and global governance system. The United Nations was born 75 years ago. Uh, we have just celebrated the adoption of the United Nations Charter, which was done in San Francisco uh, 75 years ago. Our basic aim was to succeed, succeeding generation from scourge of war, and also reform faith in fundamental human rights and promote the social and economic uh, prosperity for all. This has been major, major goals of the United Nations and uh, leading by, led by the United States and other countries like European countries, United Kingdom, France and uh, Germany and all uh, Europeans and the mostly OECD countries. I think we have been really been successfully leading this world toward a better future. The United Nations has adopted sustainable development goals on September 25th, 2015, and also in the same year, in December, the historic Paris change, climate change agreement was adopted. Those two were adopted during my time as a Secretary General, and these are two most proud achievements which had taken place during my time as a Secretary General. Now that uh, with the administration of Trump uh, sworn in, the, in just uh, three and a half years ago, there has been growing disunity in our multilateral system. People say that the multilateral system has been under attack even, not to say uh, even under threat, in the, under attack. The US has been withdrawing from major specialized agencies of the United Nations starting from uh, UN Human Rights Council. The United Nations has been respected because of their respect and support for human dignity. Then they have withdrawn. Then they have withdrawn from UNESCO. Then uh, uh, Paris Climate Change Agreement, most seriously. Now, US has withdrawn from a very important security uh, pact, uh, like uh, uh, JCPOA, Joint uh, Comprehensive Plan of Action on the Iranian nuclear issue. They have um, uh, canceled this INF, Intermediary uh, Nuclear Forces Treaty. And now if um, there is no action taken between the United States and Russia, this a new start treaty may end uh, February next year. I'm really urging the United States really show their global leadership group based on global vision as they did when they were leading uh, this establishment founding the United Nations 75 years ago. You have the Ban Ki-moon Center for Global Citizens. You're part of the elders. What would you like your legacy to be? I'd like to uh, be remembered as a person who has been really striving to foster global citizenship to the global leaders and also particularly young people. Frankly speaking, I do not have much expectation on current global leaders, whoever one may be, but they are all aiming for short-term political gains. This is a hugely uh, shameful and uh, unfortunate.